The applicator of Bone Alive granules has been designed to fulfill the needs of demanding surgical procedures. The applicator includes a shovel extension device, which facilitates the implantation of the moistened granules into the bone defect. In septic bone surgery, bacteria are present in the bone defect, and this is why it is important that bone alive granules can inhibit bacterial growth. Immediately after implantation, the surface reactions will give rise to an increase in the local pH and will make the microenvironment of the bone alive granules alkaline. In addition, an increase in the salt concentration due to the release of ions from the bioactive glass will elevate the osmotic pressure in the surroundings. These two mechanisms will effectively prevent the adhesion and colonization of the bacteria on the bone alive granules surface and prevent bacterial growth. The bacterial growth inhibition has been evidenced through in vitro studies with over 50 clinically relevant bacteria species including MRSA and MRSE, and by empirical observation of patient data for over a decade. After a while, a silica gel layer will be formed on the surface of bone alive granules, and this surface acts as a template for calcium phosphate precipitation. The precipitated calcium phosphate crystallizes spontaneously to natural hydroxyapatite, which is the main component in natural bone. This newly formed surface of natural hydroxyapatite lays the foundation for the highly osteoconductive nature of bone alive granules. Within one to two weeks after implantation, the natural hydroxyapatite surface will completely cover the bone alive granules and will initiate the process of osteointegration. The granules will thereafter activate a biological osteostimulative process that promotes the recruitment and differentiation of the osteogenic cells, which increases the local rate of bone remodeling and healing of the bones.